And tonight is the third year of interfaith night skating at the Hunt Armory in Pittsburgh. Alexandra Todd shares why this event holds a deeper significance than in years past. Alexandra. Yeah, Erica, after what happened on the other side of the world today, Pittsburghers chose to put aside their differences. Earlier today, 13 Israelis and four other foreign nations were released from the Gaza Strip. 39 Palestinian prisoners were released as well as part of a hostage exchange between Israel and Hamas during the second phase of their deal to free hostages. There is an LED light display at the Temple Sinai in Squirrel Hill representing all of the hostages. Rabbi Daniel Fellman said he plans to remove a number of them for those who have been released. But in Shadyside tonight, leaders of different faiths put the conflict overseas out of mind, gathering together for interfaith night skating at the Hunt Armory. We have folks here from many different denominations and religions and we're just having fun together. Reverend Jonathan Jensen says he had a vision that Catholics, Protestants, Jews and Muslims would gather together and be friendly despite what is going on in the world. We have Protestants, Catholics, Orthodox, Jews and Muslims all come together to skate and this year I'm very pleased to say that all the groups agreed after uh, the recent attack by Hamas in the Middle East. So this is an intentional way to be together. Reverend Jensen says this event is not political. It, this, this event is not political at all. This event is not necessarily proselytizing at all either. It's simply a time for neighbors to be neighborly and to be friends with one another. It's a Pittsburgh thing. Christopher Karas, who serves as the head of Islamic Center for Pittsburgh, believes it is possible to all be in the same room together. Showing that we can participate with one another, people of different faiths, different backgrounds, different beliefs and ideologies, can practice staying in the room together with difference. At the end of the day, we're really all the same on the inside. At this free event tonight, Pittsburghers all decided to focus on unity. In Pittsburgh, Alexander Todd, KDK TV News.